Hey Libra, how's it going? It's Ashley from Serendipity Tarot and this is your general love reading for the end of May 2021. We're going to see what's going on for you guys. This is for Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Take what resonates, leave the rest, okay? Check out your, your Moon, your Rising, your Venus. If you're interested in a personal love reading, the links are in the description box. You can also head over to my Etsy shop. Um, buy a personal reading there you can also buy my tarot my oracle decks my spiritual jewelry all right let's jump right in libra all right we're gonna see what's going on your bonus extended how does my partner feel whoever you're thinking about dealing with that is up on vimeo we're gonna look at what's going on with them what's on their mind how do they view you feelings emotions what are they not saying okay all right let's jump right in libra Libra, Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, and Venus. Clear messages here, please. This is the Essential Tarot, in case you're asking. This is the Essential Tarot deck. All right, the current energy we have is the moon in reverse, okay? Some of you guys, you're dealing with someone who perhaps... um wasn't really completely open and honest with you. They could have hid things from you, Libra, okay? You could have known, you could have felt it, okay? I'm getting like you felt something was up. Um, something here was revealed, okay? And it could be um, what's, what's currently going on or why things are changing because something here has come out. Something was revealed. Maybe you had some fears about it. We do got the lovers in reverse, okay? So some of you guys, you had a falling out with someone here. It could be a Gemini, Cancer, Pisces. Also could be a Scorpio here. Um, it looks like you guys are either on a breakup or someone made a decision recently, okay? Someone could have made a decision to part ways. Someone could have decided that this isn't for me anymore, okay? I don't want to um, be in this partnership or in this connection. But I do feel like there was a very strong connection with whoever you were dealing with, Libra. But I feel also this is someone who could have had some fears. They could have had some fears about investing, okay? Eight of Pentacles. It could have been uh, someone who was afraid to commit. Someone who was afraid to, um, you know move towards something that was a little bit more serious and more solid okay that moon could talk about fears blocks um the unknowns okay so let's see what happened in the past in the past we have the nine of pentacles in reverse and we have the seven of cups in reverse i feel like in the past there was definitely um an expectation that you guys would be able to come together in some kind of relationship okay i feel whoever you're dealing with maybe you guys have been dating casually for some time but someone wanted something more someone wanted something more secure and i feel like there was a lot of confusion here with the seven of cups as to where this was gonna go i do feel someone could have had options someone could have been playing around and creating some kind of confusion Confusion in the past here Libra and I feel like their intentions were not very clear as to whether they wanted some a relationship or not all right in the past we also had the ace of swords in reverse so this is someone who was holding back you could have been dealing with someone who was very dishonest with you and that's what that moon in reverse something here came out regarding this person's um you know secrets okay some of you guys this is someone here who you felt you just couldn't talk to them, okay? This Ace of Swords could be your energy, Libra. Maybe you felt like you had to cut this person off, right? You felt like you were honest and open and transparent and straightforward, and this person wasn't. I feel a lot of you guys, it was a great challenge to communicate with this person, okay? Whether you guys, there was a lot of miscommunication or um, broken communication. Some of you guys could be dealing with another air sign, okay? A Gemini, another Libra, or Aquarius. Let's see what's on your mind, um, Libra. We have the seven of pentacles in reverse with the wheel. So a lot of you guys, you want the circumstance, the situation to change, right? And a lot of you guys, you want it to change in your favor. You want some kind of forward movement. I do feel like there's a lot of thinking and reflecting on what you have contributed to the connection, which perhaps could have been a lot. I feel a lot with the seven of pentacles that um, a lot of you guys, you feel like you are really invested, right? You really um, put everything, your blood, your sweat, your tears into this relationship. And it's unfortunately that something did not plan out the way that you anticipated. But I also feel like there's a lot of change within you, Libra, and you want change and you're getting that change. And it does look like the wheel is moving in your, in your favor, in the direction, okay? In the right direction. Let's see what's going on in a foundation external to you, Libra. What are you unaware of? 
Libra, we do have the justice in reverse, okay, and the temperance. Could be done with a Sagittarius or another Libra. Um, now, if this is your your energy, Libra, with the justice in reverse, a lot of you guys, you turned your back on someone here, okay? Um, and you could have had very good reasons to. It's telling me that your person may be um, learning learning important lesson of patience, okay? This is someone who may want to take action toward you, but they may be very patient right now um, because they realize that they've done an injustice to you or they did something to get you upset, okay? For you to turn your back on them, for you to not be interested in what they have to offer now, okay? There's some kind of injustice or imbalance here, which is why your person may be now trying to bring some balance here with the temperance, okay? Trying to bring some equilibrium back to this connection. Let's see. What else we need to know here? What's in the foundation? We also have the Empress in reverse, okay? This is a uh, an extra card, y'all. <laughs> and the King of Swords. That's your energy, Libra. Um, The Empress came out in the verse, so this is telling me that there's definitely... um. An energy where you guys are not wanting to, you can't come together just yet. Um, I feel like your person is well aware that you're blocking them, that you're not interested, that you're not nurturing the connection because perhaps they weren't nurturing it when you were ready to nurture it. I feel that someone feels abandoned by you. They feel like you don't care about them right now. Um, and there is the energy of them wanting to communicate with you, Libra. Okay, we got the King of Swords. You guys may be very much both wanting to communicate right now and speak some truth, be honest and open about something that's been going on, especially if you guys are on a break and you haven't really been talking much. Let's see what the outcome looks like here for Libra and their person. We have the Ten of Cups in verse, the Nine of Rods, and the Three of Cups. So, yeah, it does look like a lot of you guys, um, there's a lot of unhappiness right now. There's definitely energy of wanting wanting to come together, okay? The, the Three of Cups is a reconciliation or a reunion, wanting to, let's just make Let's just let's just make peace with the past, right? Let's just overcome whatever we um any hiccups and let's move forward. Let's have harmony. Let's come in union. This could be also saying, hey, let's go out to eat. Let's go out and have some coffee and talk about it. Because ultimately you're dealing with someone who still wants to fight for this connection, Libra. The nine of wands, um, nine of wands, nine of rods. <laughs> this is someone who still hasn't given up. Okay. They're very passionate about you, about the connection. They haven't entirely just thrown down you know, the wands yet. This is someone who's still fighting for what they believe in and they do believe in this connection that it can go somewhere. Um, because, well, this is someone who actually saw the Ten of Cups with you. Right now, you guys don't have the Ten of Cups. Um, they could be quite miserable without you right now and very unhappy and unsatisfied. So I do feel like this is someone who wants to push for some kind of reunion or um, coming together with the Three of Cups energy, okay? So let's get some clarity. For my Libras, what messages do we have for my Libras? Libra, Sun, Moon, Rising, Venus. Any other messages? If this is your reading, like, share, comment, and subscribe. I also have a business course. I don't know if you guys are aware. Um, I do... Um, I have a business course that I posted onto Vimeo. And that it goes into deep... Um, breakdown of how I started my business. If you're interested in starting your online tarot YouTube business, I share my business strategies, real life data analytics, all that. Um, it's on Vimeo. I also do business consulting now. Um, all the information will be in the description box, okay, for those if you guys are interested. All right, let's see. I had like a brain freeze. <laughs> the moon, the moon in reverse, the lovers in reverse with an eight of pentacles. Something is being revealed or something was revealed, okay, in a current moment that has caused a division in this connection here. Whatever happened, it, the challenge is to see, well, can we still work on this? Can we still build and come together here with the eight of pentacles? I feel a lot of you guys, the energy is telling me that both of you guys still want this. Both of you guys truly do still feel like there's potential for something to grow, okay? If you guys can come together and get on the same um, ground, okay? Be on the same page with Three of Pentacles. There is an opportunity here that may be still um, there for you guys to make something work and come together. But I also feel like this is someone, you know, whoever you're dealing with, someone is going to have to overcome something that's caused a lot of stress, frustration, okay? There's someone who's been in their head about this, overthinking. This could be you, Libra, especially if you are, you know, because you're an air sign. In the past, the Ace of Swords came out in reverse. So um, Ace of Swords in reverse 
the seven of cups with the knight of pentacles in reverse so let's see the empress the four of swords in reverse with the judgment so it looks like in the past there was a big decision that was made that may have caused again um the four of swords you guys to just stop talking block communication someone could have felt like there was just too much conflict there was too much confusion here with the seven of cups and someone wasn't really being honest someone perhaps wasn't being honest if they really wanted to give and invest and nurture this connection here with this empress energy i feel like there was great potential for this to move forward but someone was very confused um as to what they really wanted if they really wanted a relationship and i feel like someone the other person just felt you know what you don't want it okay and there was just a lot of conflict and i see a decision had to be made so on your mind libra i feel with the seven of pentacles what's this about there's a lot of thinking reflecting six of swords and the seven of wands i feel a lot of you guys you have um really stood up for yourself this is about you setting your boundaries you making it very clear on where you stand and what you want okay especially right now libra you may have told this person that you know what this is what i'm looking for and if you're unwilling to give that to me then i'm gonna go elsewhere because that six of swords is really trying to get out of conflict right if there was something here that just was very confusing you couldn't read this person you didn't understand what the hell they wanted you guys are letting that go right even if you've invested years into this connection a lot of you guys you don't want to be in this place of confusion you want change here with the wheel right and a lot of you guys you're choosing a different direction and you're standing up for yourself right and you're setting boundaries which is very good setting boundaries with that seven of wands so the justice in reverse your person does realize they did an injustice to you right things were not fair we have the emperor and the three of swords see they saw you as you know you were ready to move forward you were ready to take control of the connection a lot of you guys are ready to settle down they saw you as very responsible very reliable very um strong-willed okay loyal the thing is is that someone caused a lot of hurt the three of swords here someone could have been again keeping options open it could have been a third party um but someone caused a lot of hurt to the other person libra so if this is your three of swords they do see and recognize that you're healing from it they realize that they caused you a lot of hurt for sure emotional pain and that's perhaps why you're upset with them or why you've gone in a different direction with the justice in reverse okay now this is someone who may be also wanting to step up and be this emperor let's find out what the temperance is about sagittarian energy here why is the temperance here they may be patient okay waiting for the right opportunity ace of pentacles the king of cups and the queen of wands in reverse I'm seeing that someone here now, that definitely could have been um, a Cancer, Pisces, Scorpio, you got Leo, Sag, Aries. I feel some of you guys, this could be the third party if there was a third party. If that's the case, there could have been an ending of some sort within a third party. Uh, a commitment external to the connection could have been with the Queen of Wands, could have been with the King of Cups, okay? What I'm seeing is that this caused um, a hiccup. This caused a hiccup because I feel a lot of you guys, now your person has to wait for you to overcome something that was very, very hurtful, okay? Because whatever that situation was, um, they weren't able to invest in you, right? They gave your the love to someone else they gave you know they put their time and energy into other things that were not important and a lot of you guys you felt like this person didn't care enough for you they didn't love you they didn't nurture you with the empress in reverse okay um it took a toll on your self-esteem and a lot of you guys are being patient because they know they cause hurt and they know you need time to let go to overcome something that was very challenging and troubling for you so the king of swords how they see moving forward with you is um having communication talking to you um regarding the seven of cups and the knight of swords in reverse a lot of you guys they want to tell you that um they're you know they want to have a conversation about the past okay they about their opportunities or their options with you they want to see if there is still an um opportunity for them to communicate with you about something or tell you the truth about something that they've been ignoring or they have been um avoiding or just you know this is someone who was avoiding communication apparently okay this is someone who wants to now clear the air or tell you why there was so much confusion okay they want to clear the air and speak truth about the confusion that you felt okay so if you felt there was something very confusing you didn't know where you stood they're wanting to speak truth because this is something they've been avoiding okay they also feel like you don't really know what was going on and they now want to speak about it that's what i'm seeing let's see the ten of cups in reverse 
nine of rods with the three of cups so there definitely is an energy of wanting um to reconcile yeah ace of cups look at that ace of cups with the justice in reverse because libra this is someone who wants to offer you love now they may see you going in a different direction libra because of justice in reverse but this is someone who wants to offer you a new opportunity right they're not happy where they are with you not satisfied they're emotionally unfulfilled and the nine of wands is speaking about even if there's been challenges struggles ups and downs this is someone who hasn't given up they do want to still fight for something with regard to the connection even if things are very much in balance right now right the three of cups um eights of cups three of cups this is someone who's like you know what um let's come together and see if we can have this new beginning let's come and reunite um let's see what you know the future has in store for us so that is what i'm seeing here libra um if this is your reading do give it a like share comment and subscribe i appreciate it greatly um, let me get some unspoken love messages. This is for those who um, resonated with this particular um, spread, okay? So let's see what are some messages from your person. What do they want to tell you that they can't tell you, especially if they're not talking right now? Um, this is the unspoken love messages on my Etsy shop for those of you guys who are interested, okay? What messages do we have for Libra's person? I hope we can come back together and pick up where we left off. See, this is someone who wants to come back in your life. They want to offer a new beginning with you. They're not happy, right, where things stand. And they want to pick up where things left off, the three cups. Let's get, let's have a reunion. Let's have um, some cake and ice cream, right? <laughs> let's have some coffee. That's my favorite thing, right? I like tarot. Herbs, oils, coffee, <laughs> those are my favorite thing. Crystals. <laughs> All right, let's see. Um, I know it was random. Random. All right, what are the messages we have for Libra's person? Give me more time. I am working on being a better counterpart for you. So Libra, yeah, there's something about time. The temperance came out. Okay, there's something about time to be done with the Sagittarius, but someone feels maybe you need more time or, um, you know, they need more time to get themselves together before they can come toward you. Okay, so let's get one more. They want to be better. And we have deliver me from temptation. Some of you guys, there was temptation. There was a third party. There was, you know, temptation can be like that devil energy, right? There was someone that was perhaps tempting, tempting them or making them go in a different direction or making them make bad decisions, okay? All right, Libra, your bonus is up on Vimeo. How does your person feel from the 20th to the 31st if you're interested in checking that out? If not, it's cool. You guys have a great week, all right? Take care.